Welcome back to Husky Squad. For those who are new, I'm Victoria. Here is Yuna. And here is Titus. And here's Kimari. And JC is behind the camera. Hey guys. And it's a beautiful Sunday morning. Well, around brunch time. It's a nice warm day. And we figured why not take one of the delicious snack type of recipes that JC and I like having ourselves and share it with the Husky Squad as a light breakfast snack. Obviously, this is not the type of breakfast that you could feed all the time. It has great nutritional benefits, but it's not something you want to feed every single day. This is a great treat when you want to enjoy something with your pup together on the weekend for a special treat meal. If you like recipe videos and all kinds of home type of recipes that you can share with your dog, like this video and let us know in the comment section that you want more of these so we'll create more. This is entirely up to you if you want to see more of these types of videos on our channel. All right, we're going to go inside. We'll show you how to make this delicious recipe and discuss some great nutritional benefits of this simple, easy dish that you can share with your pup. See you in the kitchen. All right, guys. If you've been with us for a while, you already know that we enjoy having the squad with us for everything and even in the kitchen. How do we achieve that? By setting the mood right from the beginning with calm and relaxing energy that can stay with us throughout the entire process. Stick around for this entire video where I'll be sharing very helpful information including how to avoid problems when introducing new types of foods to your pup. Our first ingredient is blueberries. After rinsing the blueberries, I grab about 80% of them, put them in a bowl, and using a potato masher, I press and squeeze the blueberries down. This releases the juices and the flavors and it's gonna make for a great tasting parfait. You can also use blackberries, strawberries, raspberries, fresh or frozen, it's your choice. But what you want to make sure is that they are organic. Conventional and non-organic berries are sprayed with so much pesticides that it makes it really worth it to get the organic version instead. In the description of this video, I'll leave you a link with the exact measurements that I use for the squad, but feel free to add more blueberries or less blueberries. This really depends on you. All right, guys, let's talk about the amazing benefits of blueberries for you and for your dog. First of all, it's a great antioxidant. It fights free radicals and it even fights cancer cells. Blueberries are also a great anti-inflammatory, which helps fight cancer, allergies, heart disease, joint disease, autoimmune diseases, and so much more. Blueberries also detoxes the liver, which is one of the most critical organs in the body. The liver plays such a critical role in our well-being. It produces nutrients and it helps your dog purge toxins from food and the environment. These little berries are also packed with beneficial vitamins like vitamin C and K. Let's cut open some of these blueberries to release its delicious aroma. As the squad has been having great manners while I prepare this dish, I want to practice positive reinforcement to let them know this is wonderful. This is exactly how I want them to be when I'm preparing food in the kitchen. The 
Before we continue with this recipe, I want to mention something very important. If your pup has never had blueberries or any kind of berries or yogurt or whatever food that you want to introduce, your best bet is that you introduce one ingredient at a time in a small amount over the course of about a week. This will let you know if your pup is okay with it, if your pup doesn't have allergies with that ingredient, instead of having to figure out what upsets your dog's stomach. So pay attention to that. Perfect example. This is organic, plain yogurt, but if you've never given this to your dog, your best bet is to give them a little teaspoon to lick, see how it goes. If your pup is doing okay, you can give a little bit more before you continue giving a full parfait like we're creating in this video. For this recipe, we are using plain organic whole yogurt. Be sure to check the label that there's absolutely nothing else in that jar of yogurt. No sugar, no fruits, no additives, just plain whole organic yogurt. All right, let's combine the pressed blueberries with the yogurt, mixing it and wrapping it in delicious flavor. You can of course add more blueberries if you like, it's entirely up to you, but I like pressing it instead of blending it because it creates wonderful texture. For delicious flavor, a pop of color, and a burst of nutritional benefits, I'm adding fresh chopped mint to this parfait. Mint leaves are amazing, let me share with you. Because mint has such great antiviral, antimicrobial, antibacterial, and antifungal properties, it helps freshen your pup's breath. Mint leaves is also a great source of fiber roughage, and it helps in good digestion, and it also soothes an upset stomach. Mint leaves are also a great source of trace minerals such as calcium, copper, iron, magnesium, folate, potassium, zinc, they all play a key role in balanced nutrition. Organic plain yogurt is a great source of live culture probiotics and also a wonderful source of B vitamins, calcium, and cancer-fighting CLA. Some dogs may be allergic to dairy, so you want to be sure to test with small amounts before giving this much in one time. In mine and JC's parfait, I'm adding a hint of sweetness with organic honey, and you can also add some granola for yourself too. Just be sure to keep it simple for your pup and only use the three basic ingredients. You don't need to add any sweetener and you definitely don't want to add any grains, so you can add some extra toppings for yourself, but keep your pup's parfait nice and simple. Since this is not the first time that the squad is enjoying these parfaits with us, they already know that they're in for a treat. They are definitely excited for this. No matter what, 
we always work on good manners, especially something really delicious like this. I have to make sure that we stay on top of the training and keep a nice, calm environment. We love doing everything with the Husky Squad. It doesn't matter if we're at home sharing a delicious treat meal, or if we're out hiking together in the mountains, or if we're traveling together in the car on long road trips, or we're cabin hopping, or waterfall chasing. It doesn't matter what it is. We love doing everything with the Husky Squad. This is just another great thing that we feel connects and bonds us to be able to share a meal. It's obviously not for every day, but this is a great way to spend some quality time with your dog and for them to feel like they're even more part of your life. If you like this video and you want more treat recipes that you can share with your dog, be sure to like this video and comment on this video letting us know that you want more of these type of videos. If you want to know how we feed a Husky Squad an amazing raw healthy diet for over a year now, be sure to go to huskysquad.com, subscribe to our newsletter because we're working on something very special. As soon as it's ready, it may already be there when you visit or we'll let you know as soon as it's live. Thank you guys so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed this video. We hope this inspired you. Be sure to subscribe to our channel. We have lots more coming as always. And also share this video with family, with friends, showing them what is possible, what kind of a relationship you can create with your dog and the delicious meals you can share together. Thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you next time on Husky Squad.